Um, so I'm in the middle of editing the tower video. I just noticed how long the floor 29 section is. <laughs> Out of all the floors in Heavenly Tower or Infernal Tower, out of all the floors, Floor 29 of Infernal Tower is definitely one of the levels. I have done Q pretty much every day since it appears. Unfortunately, it's not enough to get Courier up yet. I have like six purple. It do be like that sometimes, but you know, whenever you just do like, like the last map of the Behemoth Calling Stage. One brick! One coal! Oh, uh, hell yeah! One goal! Now that's what I'm talking about. We are on Singularityville. This is super close to the end of SOL. I think this is SOL 46, if I'm not mistaken. That does mean that I have gone through pretty much one of the stupidest stage in SOL, Heaven's Oasis. <laughs> this is what I ended up with with Heaven's Oasis. Masamune is pretty good, I'll, I'll have to say. Honestly, it's like ever since I got Masamune, whenever I want to do stuff off stream and then just want to have like a generalist damager, Masamune is pretty much my first choice now, which is pretty nice. He's actually decent. Other than that, there is also COTC progression. I've tried to gold a lot of stuff. I'm only missing one more one more treasure set. The main reason on why I even rushed COTC at the first place, like COTC 3 wasn't really th like that big of a priority for me, but one of the reasons on why I even want to finish off the treasure at the first place is for Aku Realms. <laughs> Uh, this stage, Hollywood. This mole is strong as fuck. <laughs> I need to farm treasures just for this stage, not even for the others. It's literally just for Hollywood. <laughs> it's so bad. Uh, for now, let's just roll. <laughs> we have 39 tickets. Epic Fest is on right now. I have all these tickets saved up. You know, I want to roll on stream, right? I want to roll on stream. So I just keep on holding this ticket. I really want units from certain sets. Mainly dynamites and girl spawns. I think like every girl spawns ubers are pretty mediocre enough to not be super strong to be banned and also uh, still strong enough to be used. So yeah, let's just roll for epic fest. Who knows? We might actually get. No wait, we can we get girl spawns from here? I actually don't remember. You can get it from here too. Oh, that sucks. Why is that still not a thing? That's really sad because girl spawn is technically a collab. Uh, yeah, but still, just purely for how long girl spawn has been around in battle cats, it's basically almost like a battle. Cat's only unit right now. Especially considering that Girls Mon's game is pretty much dead anyways. Oh, oh, oh shit! I, I want this, I want this, I want this, I want this. Ah uh, hell yes, I'm using this. Catapult, baby! You know one of the main reasons on why I want catapult? Okay, look at this, right? Out of all the units that I have that I don't ban, Saki is my only LD. <laughs> Saki is my only LD unit that I don't ban. Having Catapult, which is pretty mediocre, and LD is going to fill a role that I don't have for a very, very long time. This is definitely going to be a core unit that I have. That's definitely a good pull. That's definitely a good pull. I tried Siege Engine's Wave Talent. It's not amazing, but it's funny. Oh, do I... Do I use her? Okay, like, uh, the whole Misly effect aside, isn't she kinda still pretty strong, though? Doesn't everyone shit on Misly, though? I feel like uh, the main reason why everyone shits on Misly is because they look up Misly Syndrome, and they don't actually understand what Misly Syndrome is, and they just decide, oh, that means Misly is shit. Okay, I get it. But, like, that's... No... <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I want you to use Misley to showcase her power. You know, that's not a bad point, honestly. She is underrated. I think she is underrated. Yeah, yeah. You know what? Yeah, I'll use. I'll use her. I'll use her. Oh my god. I am using him. I am using him. You know, this is also another thing. I think his true form is a little bit underrated. I think his true form is actually kind of okay. Definitely a use. A lot of people really shits on Nubi Luga. I think his true form is a little bit okay. Oh shit. This means I have two LD units that I can use. Oh my gosh. This is a very good roll. <laughs> One knockback and me into knockback. Yeah, that is that is funny though. That is kind of funny. Will you roll Annihilation City Guaranteed Banner? Probably not. Aside from just wanting a, you know, like weaker or less known unit or stuff like that, there are also units that I'm just straight up not interested in. And collab units are amongst them. I'm not really that interested in collab units. Uh... I don't know anything about you. 
I don't know anything about Dutch Roy. I actually completely ignore you. I, I have to look this up. I legitimately don't even know what he does. He's mid, he's shit, kinda poopy. Okay, I see how it is. 69,000 HP, nice. Uh, three knockbacks. 26,000 damage, 4k DPS. 475 range. Oh, that's pretty big. 3,400 cost? That's pretty cheap. Uh, of course, 180 seconds respawn because of course, it's a, it's a goddamn Iron Legion. It always has a super long ass cooldown. Massive damage and zombie killer. Honestly, when, like when I, when I saw him appearing, I was like, God, what even is his name i don't remember i could use him for cadaver bear killing that's really long four swing though wait what is his four swing 115 frames oh i see <laughs> i see <laughs> i guess that's a use then he's also slower than the slug really he's the speed is three. Oh, okay i see <laughs> you can use him to nuke aku wait is he anti-aku Oh, he is! Oh, he's anti-Aku as well? Oh, I, oh, okay. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I can use him for Mexico. And also anti-Angel? Wait, yeah! Wait, what the fuck? He's tree traded? I want to see this guy now. Mighty the Troy R. Marauding cats on board an assault engine powered by Aku energy. He's riding out to conquer the waves. Massive energy damage to zombie angels and Aku. So it's triple typing. It's 3,400 cost. That's pretty cheap. It's range is 475. That's super big. This is pretty big. I think this is pretty nice. I can see why a lot of people wouldn't want to use him. But from my perspective, he actually looks pretty good. Aside from the bad four swing, his overall stats looks pretty nice. Uh, uh, especially considering that it has triple typing. I think this is going to be a very powerful unit in my arsenal. If you guys say it's bad, then more power to me. Hell yeah. That's all we have for now. All of these are, yeah, all of these are units that I can use. Wow, that just dawned on me. We got four new Ubers. That's crazy. That's actually kind of crazy. I don't know who to focus on first. I think Catapult. I think Catapult is my main focus. Misery for Horopotamus. Look, look, man. If Horopotamus appears... I am not going to play it. <laughs> I'm not going to play Horror Potamus. I'll tell you that right now. I'm not going to play Horror Potamus. <laughs> Fuck that. Fuck that. I'm not playing that shit. <laughs> Finish as well the stream? No. That's for another time. For now, let's just do no plan A. Oh, wait. No, it's, it's, it's off. Should I do Temptation Symphony instead? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I I want to do no plan A. It's been it's been a long time coming. I want to do no plan A. Time to take a nap. No, we're we're moving time backwards. First try, second try, or more than two tries. Right now, there's 20k points on more than two tries. Uh, meanwhile, first try and second try is only like 2,000 and 3,000 points. It's like everyone everyone is doubting me. Oh my god, what 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 did I do to you? To be fair, I am on I am on the mercy of Slipnir. I believe in you. Losing. I see. I see how it is. You can do it. Well, say that to Slipnir. Oh yeah, it's Return of Inquired Clippy Deadly. Hell yeah. Wait, what did I... Why is Can Can there? I don't remember spawning you. What the fuck? That's three units. Oh no! Oh no! Oh fuck. Wait, what? What? Sli Fuck! What was that? Okay, fuck you. Fuck you, Slipnir. Should I just bring Manic Lion? I feel like this is the more obvious choice. I I'm just gonna bring Manic Lion. I will become back my points. What, what, do you, what do you mean, I will become back my points? Is that is that like the origin story of like Mr. Morbius? You know how Mr. Morbius appears on screen and says it's Morbin time? That's like the most powerful scene in cinema. I, I love it when he, when he does that. Did you guys watch Morbius? Did you guys watch Morbius? I love that scene. I love that scene where he says, it's time to Morb. And then he, he Morbed all over the opponent. I, I love that. Okay. What the f Uh Bahamut, get out of there! No, Bahamut, you fool! Oh my god. Bahamut failed to sell one more billion tickets. What? Really? <laughs> Wait, seriously? I, I still doubt that I'm going to win, but can I even get Bahamut out? Uh nope. Uh, well, unfortunate. Very unfortunate. I can't believe the Doubters has made one more billion surplus in points. You guys are eating in more billion tickets right now. Lionel <laughs> Sweep. <laughs> yep, that's correct. Digimon Cyber Sleuth? I have no idea what that is. I mean, I know what Digimon is, at least. I think back then, I used to play, like, this one Digimon... What is it called? Is it Digimon Rumble Arena? That game was pretty sick. 
I actually I, I actually really like that game. I think I use Renamon a lot. I think that's the name of the uh, character. Okay. Oh, is that far enough? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> uh, not really sure if I can get Awakened Bahamut out though. I don't think we can get Awakened Bahamut out as fast as we need to. Uh, I think we're gonna die first. And Clyonel is still hitting the base. Yeah, we're fucked. Oh, that's unfortunate. That was surprising. Wow, we killed the Slipnir! If Clyonel did not hit the base, we actually had a chance there. Earlier, I think the Slipnir was not close enough to... Hold on. Okay, hold on. Let me, let me think. Let me think. Earlier, the Slipnir was not close enough to play on Nell. So I think what we need to do... Should we stall him a little bit more? Either I one stall Slipnir when he's on the way to base, or two, I get to kill the Gori faster and push faster. That's pretty much my two choice here. Stop strategizing. Shut the fuck up. This is what I do. I mean, I, I can still lose. Lionel is not easy to calculate the distance. <laughs> Let's just begin closer, actually. I think this might be the better choice. Uh... You... You what? Oh, you little fuck! Oh no no no! It works! It works! It works! Okay okay okay! Time to rush in! Oh my gosh! What was that? <laughs> that was so scary! Oh no, Bahamut! Okay, no, that's fine. We push far enough. We push far enough. Oh no! Get out! Oh fuck! Our base is super damaged. Bahamut is almost up. Go! Oh no! Is it? Are you too far? No! Oh my god! God damn it. Maybe Twin Stars multi hit isn't really doing well. Oh wait, I'm having a thought right now. Let me let me think though. I was thinking can I use that Troy R? Because that Troy R have massive damage against angels, but the Troy R might kill the Gori, but that'd be it. I mean, that's pretty much all I need. I just needed to kill the Gori. I'll give you a try. What even is your name? Siege Walker Diabolosa. No No wonder nobody fucking remembers you. This name sucks. I guess Siege Walker is kind of alright. I don't know. <laughs> I don't really know much about Ether either, actually. I actually just straight up not paid attention to the two latest Iron Legion. <laughs> like, I, I, I actually forgot about their existence for quite a while. <sighs> you little... No! Oh my god, that's... I'm, I'm restarting. <laughs> is that massive damage against up? Is that massive or insane? Oh, is that the one with like really weird Omni Strike? That's the, that's the one, right? Insane? Massive? <laughs> Which is it? Uh, okay. Slip there, please. Slip there, please. Oh my god. Yay! I... Fuck this horse! Oh my god! What is up with the slip there? Fuck you! Logistic does insane damage chance to dodge? Excuse me? <laughs> 370 rage, minus 730 to 370. That's weird. That's so weird. What the fuck? In true form? Wait, it has a true form? I don't even know it has a true form. <laughs> Just watch your own video of this stage. Yeah, but my own video also relies on RNG. You think I won first try on New Testament? No. I think I've said this a lot before, but I've said that New Testament is one of my favorite stage in Battle Cats. And one of the main reasons is because it kicks my ass. I like a stage that kicks my ass and has a lot of answers to it. Oh no, wait. Can I? Oh yes, my gamble worked! That's stupid, but it works. Yes, yes, okay. Almost perfect. Slip near, please. All right, time to see what you can do. Oh my gosh, yeah, that that definitely took a while, but I can set it up, so it's fine. Oh, you attack fast. Oh, you actually attack pretty fast. Oh, that's not bad at all, actually. That's fine. Nice. Lionel actually has not hit the base. Okay, let's spawn you Lala after this. There we go. And there we go. Lionel is dead. And now we still have to survive the rest though. I can still die here. Don't get too cocky. Get out. Get out. Get out of my sight. Now nah, I'll awaken Bahamut you. Fuck you. I can I can use the trial for the slip near. Oh my gosh! Bahamut got fucking destroyed there! Holy shit! Bahamut got morbed! <laughs> he is pretty slow, but he actually attacks consistently. That I actually like that about him. It's kind of funny that the, the miss sign in this stage, like, isn't even miss sign. <laughs> is there any more waves? If there's no more waves, I should have spawned Awakened Bahamut instead of Manic Lion. Oh well, it's just fine. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, we actually got 200 views right now. What the fuck? Wait, 222? Like the cat 222? Get it? It's it's a cat reference because 222? Morbius does that. Yeah, you know what? We actually got like a more billion views right now. All of the one more billion fans of Morbius starts appearing on my stream. Very good showcase of Walker for the first time. <laughs> what the frick is Morbius? It's it's the most popular movie. You haven't heard of it? Morbius is the movie ever. Yeah, it's like out of all the movies that I've watched, all of the Marvel movies to ever exist, Morbius is one of the movies. It, it's just, it's super. It's super. You know what would be funny but also could possibly ruin our run, but I still want to do it because it's funny? Fiend Cat. <laughs> Extremely unnecessary, but I'm gonna do it anyways. Just, I, I think it would be funny. Searching up, guys, shake my head. Look, man, did you seriously not remember the strat for Peptide Snowfield? I expected better from you, Lucas. I'm sorry, man. I know I'm like a failure to all guide makers around. It's kind of funny looking back. I think when Relic Doge first appeared, I thought it's like, oh gosh, this Doge is actually kind of strong and kind of scary. Little did I know, Wild Doge and pretty much taking the spot of being probably the scariest Doge of them all. Uh, probably not good, actually. This might not be good. Yeah, yeah, I kind of I kind of fucked it up. I think I should have waited for the doge, right? I should have exhausted the doge. 200% wild doge is the scariest behemoth. Yeah, to be fair, we haven't gotten, like, any other magnified behemoth yet. It's, like, 33k damage or some shit. Like, it one-shots erasers, and it has, like, 150 range, and it's AoE. That shit sometimes randomly just hits slime. What? Wait, what? The fuck was that? No! Oh! But god damn it. I was I was off by like one frame. God damn it. <laughs> I was off by like one frame on the cannon. I probably shouldn't have spawned anything in the beginning. Oh no! I forgot to turn off sniper! Oh I, I why do I keep on making so many mistakes? Okay. Cannon! <laughs> that was close. Okay, now I just need to hope for good luck. Fiend? Kind of doing work? <laughs> Fiend is so funny against Clionel. Fiend isn't even hitting Clionel anymore. F uh, Clionel is already in Fiend's blind spot. Fiend is now just purely attacking the hippo. Okay, there we go. We're done here. We're done with Clionel, let's go! Morbin Bahamut, yeah, Morbin. You know, after all those losses, he's finally had enough and he said, it's Morbin time. And he finally morphed all over the enemies. GM stands for good Morbius. <laughs> but yeah, let's go, we got Catway. Uh, thank you, Morbius. Thank you for selling me 10 billion trillion more billion tickets. Uh, thanks for sponsoring me, Morbius. Uh... <laughs> also, I just realized, I oh fuck, I, why did I just realize now I'm about to end stream? I just realized this this is still versus mass <laughs> Uh I forgot I forgot to change that. This is actually uh Morbius. <laughs> I'm definitely going to consider upgrading or even true forming some of the new units that we got. Thank you for coming. See ya. I'm going to continue and edit my Heavenly Tower video. But yeah, see ya!